Hey there everyone, welcome back to the channel. Happy Wednesday? Is it Wednesday? I think it's Wednesday. I honestly have stopped caring about what day of the week it is. Uh, I only know now when things reset for the uh, the voting stuff in Faye. <clears throat> Which there is a new one, Dancing Duo. Uh, so we'll have a video out on that tomorrow. Because my life is just a series of quizzes. Uh, at this point. But hey, look at this. We have a new banner today. <clears throat> We're going to take a look at it. Ugh, it's raining, so like my allergies are kicking in. Really bad time to have like a gargly throat and like stuffy nose. People do not trust you. Not that I've really seen anyone, because I've been inside for like three weeks now. Maybe longer. The days don't mean anything to me, <laughs> as I said. Uh, so anyway, hey, we're going to summon on this. Uh, we have our tickets. Did you guys know there are orb packs available? Oh gosh. We're not going to summon just yet. Calm down, everyone. Um, I did... I did I did get my free 5 star. It was between 3 red stones and 2 green. I have like 5 uh, hectares that I are just waiting to become distant counter fodder. Um, and I... I don't really need any Julia's or Deirdre's, so I was like, you know what, let's gamble on red. It was a little Lena, you know? Some, sometimes the risk, it just doesn't pay off, and you gotta live with the consequences, and that's, that's what I'm doing. But that just means our luck here will be good today, but it doesn't really matter, because at the end of the day, we're gonna get a Lilith, because we have a 40th free summon... Uh, thing <laughs> that exists. Um, I honestly didn't pay attention to the orbs at all. But here's the deal. Uh, more than likely, we are just going to... The, we're, we're probably just going to summon on every stone. <laughs> right? Because that, that is the most efficient bang for buck that you can get. Uh, and that means that we have a chance at getting everybody on the banner, which, you know, would be ideal. Um, but, you know, sometimes we don't we don't get things. Sometimes We might spend 135 orbs and just get a free neutral Lilith. That could happen, too. I wonder if the Pity Break resets after that. There's a lot of unanswered questions that I, that I and I'm sure other people would also like to know. Um... But we don't have those answers, and so we're gonna we're gonna see if we can figure we're gonna see if we can find those answers today. We're gonna figure them out, hopefully. Oh hey, it's Sophia. Did you know it's Sophia? In resplendent form, no less. How fantastical! Uh, resplendent video will be coming out this weekend, maybe. I'm not sure. It's not gonna be up by the time resplendent Azura actually hits feeders. I don't think. Um, but, that will be out, and I'm trying to scale it back. Because <laughs> I made a list of everybody that I wanted in. Uh, th like, everybody that I would like to see as a resplendent hero. But the list was very long. Uh, and I am fearful that that will become an editing nightmare. So, uh, if I want any kind of video quality whatsoever, we are going to have to scale it back a bit. For the sake of my own sanity and your viewing uh, pleasure. So, no chance at forest. I guess we're going to try and pull blues here. See, the beautiful thing about the 40 is if you get the unit that you want, and the IVs are, like, bad or split bad or something along those lines, you can also essentially get a free merge. Well, not a free merge, but, you know. A, hey, sorry about your luck kind of merge uh, at the end of the trail here. Which is a beautiful, beautiful thing. Beautiful thing. So, I am looking forward to that because normally, terrible things happen to me in some sessions where it's, you know, the worst bane you can imagine. Sometimes they're really good banes. Sometimes they're really good boons. Uh, what did I have? I had a plus, plus attack minus defense. Lysithia, I think is what she was. Which is really good. That's a really good thing. Those don't happen to me all that frequently. Uh, so this is kind of a nice situation. Because most of my videos are about 
a hundred to 150 orbs ish I would say that's pretty average except you know if there's somebody that I'm really after uh, in which case it could be two three hundred orbs who knows who knows it could go very high so ideally we don't run into that situation but uh, you know it's it's nice that we have see we're, we're a quarter of the way there already isn't that exciting still uh, nothing Still really nothing to ride home about, uh, but it's, it's it's happening. Um, so I talked, what did I talk about already? I already kind of briefly talked about Resplendent Heroes. Um, what else is going on in the world of heroes right now? There's going to be a Fae crossover event at some point next month, or this month actually, the end of this month and the beginning, if you missed the first one. Uh, Indragalia Lost, we'll be doing a summon session on that. I know it's not Fae. And I haven't really uploaded any Dragalia stuff, but that's mainly because, like, I don't pull on every banner. Um, I'm not really interested in doing, like, gameplay video content. And the banners or units that I am interested in, they usually give, like, a bunch of, like, daily free summons and stuff for it. So, I am... I don't know. I just kind of stopped recording those for the most part. Uh, but we should do something for the Fae event. Hey! 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 That's a Lilith! That is a Lilith! That we just got. And that's very exciting. Uh, because she was genuinely like the only one on this banner that I was halfway interested in. Um, yes. This is good. This is good. This is very good. Uh, let's let's check IVs. Let's do so it. So I know Lilith is one of those that a lot of people have been waiting for. She is minus speed, plus HP. That's not ideal. To be honest with you. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest with you. That is not ideal. Um, but that's okay. Maybe we'll get another one. Uh, maybe we'll get a merge at the end of this. Who knows? I'm probably gonna go for the merge. To be honest. Let's be real. Uh, Lilith is the one that I would probably see myself actually using. Uh, I think so. Midori must be. Midori's probably second on the list, I think. Uh, but she is a red bow. And we have other options along those lines. Um, so. But her bow is really, really good, for what it's worth. Maybe, uh, shoot, I can't remember if it's active only during combat. Uh, so maybe not if there's a Brammy Mod somewhere. But uh, either way, that is pretty much what I'm after. It's pretty much all I'm after. I think Rinkas are, are green. Oh. Oh, okay. Or Memori will be uh, our... Are green. Hey, uh, microwaving. Something that I'm sure a lot of people right now are very uh, familiar with. So that's exciting. Uh, let's. I get look at memory. This is weird because this is the third time I've had memory pop up on a banner just randomly uh, that I have been like pulling on or something, and it, it does not include the mythic banner <laughs> either so this is this is anyway uh, we'll we'll see what we got here ideally i'm just over here trying to find some rats but uh plus attack minus res all right that's not bad i can live with that um i'm pretty confident that those are the best ivs that i have seen thus far of my memory trials here uh, okay. Well, maybe maybe we'll see a forest. Maybe he'll pop up. Maybe we'll get lucky. Who knows? Probably not, though. I mean, it's the right game, at least, right? Similar game, at least. I'm genuinely surprised that we have not seen a um, forest. I have been pulling on green too, which isn't fun. <laughs> it's not fun at all. Um, 
but we haven't seen any any spare uh, wraths, which is a bummer, because I would plus 10 him in an instant. Um, I think I'm actually going to make a Soth. That's some time to think about it. And I think I'm going to go with a Soth, and I think I'm also going to make an Obro, um, just, just because. Just because. We're coming up on 400,000 feathers again. And uh, I feel like we are going to have a decent amount of those uh, over the next several weeks with the 30th anniversary and then straight into Golden Week. Um, all those. Well, look, at the, look at all these Fates characters. Look at them all. They're just popping up everywhere. Although it is in poor taste that I was just talking about Obro and then a Baruka shows up. I feel like that's a little insensitive. IS. Rude. To do that. Oh well. It is what it is. Green. Mm. Yeah, another Nino. That's exactly what I need. Definitely not Wrath. Right game, though. Alright, so our, our, our stats have reset uh, to 325 here. So that was our first full circle since the Memori uh, Lilith adventure of 2020. So, we are, uh, I kind of hope that I have at least a 3-2-5, um, going into the, the free 5-star, because I'm, I'm genuinely curious if that's going to reset or not. Like, genuinely curious if that's going to reset or not. We're just going to go down. We're going to go counterclockwise. We're going to play the odds here. Another rocks. interesting. I feel like I get a lot of Rosses, too. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Nope. Just a 3B. Just a 3B. Oh, well. Uh, we are also likely going to be having a double special banner this month. So be on the lookout for that. Um, they've been popping up every even-numbered month since, uh, what was it, December, I think is when we had our first one. And I think that was actually the occurrence where IS didn't tell us that we were going to have one. Everybody just kind of woke up that, that one day and, you know, eventually logged in and said, Oh, double special! Wish I'd saved for that. And then we got the calendar like a day or two later. <laughs> Maybe it was even that night. I don't remember. Um... But I'm pretty sure they just kind of sprung it on us. Uh, so I'm, I'm hoping that they decided not to do that again. And, because uh, I don't know. Like, I've been asked over a couple different mediums, uh, you know, should we be getting one of these? Are we going to be getting one of these? Do you think we're going to be getting one of these? And uh, I think so. I think we are. But I don't know, given the given the questions that I have been getting, and I'm sure you know a lot of other Fay tubers and whatnot have been have been getting those questions too. I'm sure they've been asked on message boards and things. Uh, I don't know that they are to the point of commonplace where people just expect them. So it would be nice if IS would release a calendar uh, that would maybe overlap, for example, with the current one, or even tonight, because this is going live same day. I think. Uh, even if they released it on the 8th, because the current calendar that we have is really only up to the 8th. That's that's the only intel that we really have. I don't even think the uh, the GHB for Iago is on the current calendar. Like, I literally think it's the 8th and then, like, to the 10th. I think the 10th is the last date on the calendar. Um, so Iago is probably going to show up on, like, the 11th, I would assume. Uh, but if we, if we had something with between that overlap, like, that would honestly be ideal. Is that going to happen? I don't know. I would appreciate it if it did. Make my life a little bit easier. Case in point, we will be having a, uh, an events uh, video as well at some point where we'll uh, try to break down who's going to be on the skills banner. I feel like that's really become the main point of why I do the events calendar videos. <laughs> to like help give some insight into what's going to be on the uh, the skills banner uh, that we haven't seen. 
and uh, try and double guess those. Sometimes it's helpful, sometimes it's not. Sometimes you get a really broad general category. Um, but usually I feel like most of the time those picks are pretty easy to, to filter out. I feel like it's it's very a common sense kind of practicality play that you gotta make. Not so much like the, uh, the Mythic and Legendary banners, those are pretty much just who knows what's up with that. We got a Norn. Can I plus 10 Norn yet? Probably. Ooh, plus speed. That's exciting. Plus speed is exciting, though. Plus speed is very exciting. I am shocked that we've yet to get a forest. Absolutely shocked. We have been pulling on multiple colorless and not seen a forest yet. What even is this game? We will not be picking up a forest for our free summon, by the way. Or not our free... Is it really a free summon? If you've already dropped 135 plus orbs to get there? Mm -hmm. I don't know what it is. I think it's 135, isn't it? Yeah. I think I did this math at some point. So we should have like 95 orbs left by the end of this. Which is... It looks pretty good. That's honestly... That's a pretty good orb stash. If I'm being real with you guys. Alright, so we're at 4%. Oof. Uh, that means... That means that we... It, it's, li it's maybe kind of likely that we get a 5 star on here, so I don't know if... I don't know if we're going to find out if this resets or not. I have not looked into it. <clears throat> I do not know. Uh, what it does, I'm sure someone has answered this somewhere. Oh, look, no chance at forced. <laughs> uh, but, uh, these are pretty much my priorities, that being uh, Midori and Lilith. Uh, and then there's a Rinka. There's a possibility for a Rinka. So let's go... Let's start upper left. Can't go wrong with upper left, right? Upper left is the way. The truth. The parries of it all. Well, that's not what we were after, was it? That's not what we were after. The upper left upper left corner has failed me. Feels bad, man. Um, I genuinely don't know who I'm going to pick now. Like, if we don't get a Rinka or a Midori here, like, I genuinely don't know who we're going to pick. That... That is a conundrum, my friends. That is a conundrum. It's like, it's making me choose between, like, catalog and fixing uh, a not-so-great bane <laughs> on the unit that I might actually use. Hey, Tiki, I hope you become a professor in a banner in the future, because that would be pretty dope. That would be pretty dope. And very exciting. Um, so if you guys still don't believe that we're getting banners out of these stupid voting things, uh, the double dancer thing kind of is a, is a strong indicator. I know they try and like backlog about six months-ish to get these, uh, these characters designed and voiced and such, which kind of fits the, a similar timeline with Brave Units. Um, I'm gonna be honest, like... The teacher thing could be like a back to school type deal, which typically happens around August, I want to say, um, or at least usually. The world is kind of thrust into chaos at this point, so who really knows at the end of the day. Um, but that would kind of come a little bit before we see the dance banner, which typically happens like early fall to late summer. And that is the next category, which is dance. Just saying. You boys just saying. Alright, could be Rinka. It is not, though. It is not Rinka. So, we should be at... We should be at four and a quarter. And we cannot summon again until we pick up our free five star. It had. It looks like it resets. Wow. That's honestly a little disappointing. I don't know if the numbers really like mean anything. Like, does 
do pity rates really mean anything at the end of the day? Probably not. Um, but you know, it is what it is at the end of it. I am leaning towards picking up a Lilith. And I don't know if that's the right call or if that's the wrong call. Hmm. Midori's bow is really good, though. But we have other bows. We have other bow options. That exists. I think I'm leaning towards Lilith. Because I'm pretty sure they're going to be neutral anyway. And I think I'm leaning towards Lilith. I think I'm going to take the Fey route. I think we're just going to go with the Lilith. We're going to see what we see what happens. I think that's what we're going to do. We're going to do that. Let's do that. I am curious to see if our if our uh, our rates really did reset though. Cuz we were guaranteed to get a 5 star, so obviously it would be 100. <laughs> okay. So we got another Lilith. It is neutral. Yep. Okay. So there you go. If you were wondering if it was neutral or not, it is definitely neutral. Uh, typically, when you see a face on a summoning stone, more than likely it's going to be neutral. So there's that. Our rates did not reset. Oh! Well, that is interesting. That is very interesting. I think we may go ahead and uh, continue then. Just until we, we get something. That is very interesting. Ooh. I am interested. All right, so we're going to dive in. We're going to dive in. We're going to... Okay, well, still no forest. All right, that's fine. <laughs> okay, yeah. Well, all right. No, still no forest. Maybe we'll get a Midori now. Maybe that'll happen. Maybe that'll happen. Maybe we'll get some random five-star again. Who knows? Possibilities are truly endless. Truly endless. But we have the orbs. We've been killing it on free-to-play live streams, so that's fun. <laughs> Might as well reap the benefits, right? This is the first Fates banner in, like, forever. Interesting. Double Mathilda. Hmm. Hmm. What are the odds? Let me calculate that at some point. Uh, we're going green, so Rinka, maybe, might be uh, behind one of these. Who knows? Or we get a Fallen Robin. Or that happens. I think it was very smart that they chose not to call him Grima, by the way. Because <laughs> now Grima can actually be like a mythic or something. Uh, Alright, well... Didn't really need him. But we got him. So that's that's a thing. Uh, let's... I, I mean, my current one is plus attack, and he's got several merges. I never really use him because Nagi exists. Uh, but we will take a look at the IVs. Plus attack minus speed. There you go. That was actually the, the original one that I had before I merged. So... <laughs> Mazel tov to us. Uh, we'll go agree again, and then when we will end on the bottom left with a red that's not a Rinka that is a Libra you know I usually like to pair up Libra and Cordelia in my awakening playthroughs however uh, Sevra with blonde hair is very strange so while I do appreciate it just don't know if I can approve of it we got smoke. Where there's smoke, there is Bon Bon. All right. Well, Ban Ban is here, everyone. <laughs> Not Matori, but that's okay. Uh, we got two Liliths for our troubles. <laughs> A plus HP Lilith. Hot damn. Um, I honestly don't know if it's if it's if that's even like worth, <laughs> or or maybe we should just stick with like the neutral one that we got and save the other one. Like, maybe that's the play. Maybe that's what we do. Maybe that's what we do. Hmm. 
Cause like she does have good she does have a good father. Like not that I'm not that I'm here to like father off Lilith, but Joint Drive Attack is pretty appealing, man. That is pretty appealing. There's some good options here. <laughs> I don't know, we'll see. We won't make any rash decisions just yet. Uh, there is no Tempest Trial that we have to like prepare for this time around, thankfully. So uh, we can take our time and, and think about the builds on these guys, which I can appreciate. Uh, but overall, uh, I don't know. I wasn't really all that jazzed about this banner in particular. Um, for those who were looking forward to these units, I'm happy for them. Like, Fates has not had a banner in a very long time, so I get it. Um, but yeah, it just... It, you know, it uh, looking back on it, I'm not really surprised that it was a Fates Banner because we had a Resplendent Azura coming in. Um, the only one who hasn't had a corresponding banner with their Resplendent occurring uh, would have actually been... I mean, I guess technically Sophia, but she's still kind of from the Blazing Binding games. And so was Bramimond, even though they're one's Binding, one Blazing, technically. Um... But yeah, the only one who really didn't get one was Ike. So... I don't know. Maybe we'll, maybe we'll see a Tully's Banner somewhere in the near future, too. Who knows? Uh, but anyway, we have a lot of other stuff coming up on the channel. Be sure to subscribe if you want to catch all of that. There's also a bell that you may be inclined to ring. I'm not going to stop you, because I think that's the only way you get notifications at this point. Because YouTube is uh, a constant work in progress. <laughs> despite being around for many, many years now. Um, but in the comments, let me know how your summon sessions went, if you decided to summon, uh, and if you decided to do the the, the five-star 40, as I am going to call it from now on, because it's not technically a free summon, if you have dropped 135 orbs plus to get it. Just one man's opinion. But uh, that's it for now. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, we will have some other videos coming out this week as well. Uh, so look forward to those if, uh, if you're feeling bored. <laughs> but uh, until then, be sure to uh, wash your hands. Um, be good to each other. Drink lots of water. And uh, just stay safe in these troubling times that we are uh, unfortunately thrust into. So uh, that's it. For now. Thanks again for watching, and I will catch you next time.